People are scared to look me in the eye. Don't misunderstand. I'm not a bully or anything. There's nothing wrong with me. It is them that is the problem. They don't love America as much as I do. I love my country more than my buttered toast in the morning. I love my country more than I love my Xbox. I love... You get the point. He always looks like that. The guy's a freak. He pretty much hates everyone in the school. No, no, it's not like that. He hates us and refuses to talk to us because we're not patriotic enough. Apparently, in eighth grade, he asked Kelly Kendall out, and she said no. That's when they decided America was his one and only love. Why do you treat my love for America like it's something new? Find something new to talk about. I was just explaining to Adeline over here why you're always alone and the only colors you wear are red, white, and blue. I figured I should warn her now. Uh-huh. I'm sorry to have angered you. I was just curious. Are you one of the new foreign kids? Well, yes. I mean, sort of. I lived in the United States for seven years and then my family moved to Paris, France. So then I've lived there ever since. But now I'm a foreign exchange student. <laughs> I'm not a fan of people who live in America who aren't actually American. If you're French, that just makes it even worse. That's why we've created things like freedom fries instead of french fries, because we hate French people. Sorry to have offended you, I... All right, class, settle down. The bell has rung, and I want you to pull out your notes. She was so proud to be from France. What is so great about that place anyway? personal French trash from the City of Love. Well, today we're going to hear about how the American Revolution would have been a very different situation had the French not come in and saved our tales, making the Brits the underdogs. Wow, maybe the French aren't so bad after all. We wouldn't even have America without them. Maybe I should give this French trash some chance. If she won't be willing to hang out with me, I think I'll just have to make her. I think she's staying with the Montgomery family. I guess I'll have to start there. How do I impress a girl? I think a Walmart run is the proper course of action. What about... Let's sign a treaty and make this official. No, no, that doesn't really work. How about... Let's get lit like it's 1776. Oh, that's not really a good... It's not a good kind of pickup line. How about... Let's make things official and write our own Magna Carta? Oh, that sounds so dumb. Um, ooh, how about let's get lit and let our own 4th of July fireworks? No, that doesn't work either. What's another pickup line I could do? Ooh, what about you have the right to bear me in your arms? Yeah, yeah, that works. That pickup line doesn't make her jaw drop. I don't know what will. Jeez, that was close. I don't think she saw me though. Can you imagine what would happen if she did?
frap. Why is she home already? That was only like five minutes. Pull yourself together and think. If I go downstairs, she, she will see me for sure. Oh, I know. Where did I put the Oh, they're in the closet. house. I think she just needs some time to think. I have one more idea. Why is there a loofah in the shower? Uh, this guy keeps giving me gifts from school. Who is this guy? He's a creepy loner. Maybe he just needs a friend. Maybe. I doubt it, but maybe I should give him a chance. Alright class, pay better attention here because now we'll find out how the French dramatically screwed over America due to the XYZ affair. Yes? Uh, what's with your coat? It's sassy, just like the French. <laughs> I don't want to hear a thing you want to say. Look, I just wanted to No, not after learning how your country screwed over America. I am done with this relationship. I should have trusted my gut when it told me that you were bad news. <sighs> I just wanted something to believe in. Oh. Kaden! You should be ashamed of yourself.